So they picked the commissioners on Monday. There are 13 commissioners. Um, there is one person that's under the age of 30, two people that identify as black, one identifies as Middle Eastern, and the rest identify as white. They are spread throughout the state, um, and they have to have their first meeting, I believe, before October 15th. I know it is sometime in October for sure. Uh, right now, it's just kind of getting in contact with everybody and making sure that they have the, the availability to do so. They're required to have 15 meetings, I believe, before they, um, well, while they're serving. They also, they're being compensated. Each of them should be receiving 40 grand um, for their efforts. And the redistricting is going to take place before the 2022nd election. So election cycle. So look forward to that. Um, it sounds like it's going to take a while. It's going to take about two years to redistrict. Uh, they'll be having meetings and public hearings. Um, all of their meetings have to be open to the public. So it seems like the public is going to have a huge role in how the state's going to be redistrict. And it seems to be like there's a lot of excitement around it. Um, it's never happened before. And I believe that other states are kind of turning to Michigan again. Um, Michigan's being spotlighted because it's uh, it's so new. And I think Michigan's really going to set the example for how this process could go.